Welcome back to our ongoing Office 365 series. In the last video, we checked the business connectivity service. And the next one is Term Store. So let's find out what it is. It takes time. So Term Store is basically um, you call it keywords, metadata. Uh, tags so since we're talking about sites and we want to have a full kind of list that defines each page what is on that page so that is the term store so it could be a set of keywords related keywords they organized into a hierarchy of information well-defined product category or material list so it could be about a user a service a, an app anything a product uh, a hardware software anything so we manage it through here so there's like people search dictionaries like you can add multiple dictionaries and system everything is grayed out because nobody has added anything into it so they have to actually go and add we will not be dealing with this one because it's just uh, uh, our job as an admin is not to define keywords and write them down right we just manage the administrator part on the back they upload it they create it like the team that's working on it it's their duty and a team is usually a bunch of people it's not like one or two person it's more like five ten fifteen at least a dozen they have different duties and like the juniors one they may have to read the pages and come up with keywords so this is what about the term store intended use so you can see the available for tagging or not and all that this information custom sort how they are there was the sorting order and finally the custom properties like what what is the property of that uh, uh, keyword or what what you have selected there is no way for me like it's not giving me an option to actually sample import file so this is import but available service application is this one so first we have to term store administrator we can put Ali as the administrator press enter and it found it next is what of the language is working I thought that <coughs> there will be an option to upload it but I'm assuming that only Ali can log into SharePoint and then he can upload the metadata or terms everything into it here so I'm gonna wrap this video here because there is really nothing and I'm pretty sure that we will not be doing like managing metadata it will be the team itself the, who have the uh, sites up and running we can view a sample uh, it's CSV file so a CSV is a huge thing all right I'm gonna wrap this video if this video has helped you please rate share subscribe comment and see you in the next one